That's all right. Well, it's not really all right, but the Shard and Tanya is all right. That's that one's a tough one to save. Ah, but we got a kill there, so that's good. All right, I'm gonna let my shields recharge real quick, and I'll be back once they have done that because I'm gonna need them for the next zone. All right, always gonna. It's always nice to have full shields, especially with what we're gonna have to deal with next. We're gonna need them. All right, so well, we still have the uh, Shar Natanya, so that's really all that matters is because it's got the supplies. So, all right, and we have to deal with. Let's see if we can pull it up here. Come on, aha, Comicus. I remember these things from the last game. Now they have some pretty powerful guns, so the two cap ships basically deal with them the same way. Just make passes at them with torpedoes. Yep, and they're already starting their process of firing at us. So we, we need to move kind of quickly because we... Ah. We need to move kind of quickly because we don't want the Shard and Tanya to get in there. Oops. Slide on a little bit there. Again, as long as you get the, as long as you get the fire off before... Uh, um... You know, before you're under 3,000 clicks, you should be okay. Come on, stay with it. Fire! And then get out of the way. Ugh. Hopefully we'll at least get one of them. Somehow I doubt it. Yeah. Alright. So anyway, that's the process, just like any other cap ships. So you want to do that before the, uh... Before it gets in there, otherwise... That could be somewhat problematic. Alright. So we're going to go lock on it. Yep. All right. So uh, I'll just repeat this process. And then I'll let you know uh, once I've taken out these two ships. All right. We got them. Yeah. And they're both gone. And it looks like the Clydesdale made it okay. So we're in good shape. Now, we could head to Nav 2 once the transport jumped out. But that means that we have to deal with uh, more enemies. And we're not going to do that. We're going to return via Nav 1. Nav 2 is actually completely optional. And so we're going to do, do it this way. Plus, we've also taken a little bit of a beating. And I really don't want to have to deal with uh, more enemies. I know it's kind of taking the cheap way out, but eh. I was never one to uh, have to follow the rules. All right, so now let's head back to Olympus. And it says that we have the sad music, but oh, wait. Uh-oh. Looks, like looks like we don't have a choice. Got to deal with some more enemies here, and that's fine. Bring them. Yeah, it's just some jockeys. No big deal. Uh, we, take, we want to take them out the exact same way. Now, this could be trickier for me since I don't have a... Uh, a redder to find out exactly what I'm doing, but... Eh, they're, no, they're really no big deal. So, okay, I'll finish up this last jockey. I'll be right back. All right, no problems there. Okay, well, now that we've done that, we might as well head over to Nav 2, because... That's really where the enemies are encountered, or is it nab, or at Nab 2. So, we'll uh, head over to Nab 2, and uh, should be okay. And, uh, oh wait, did I screw that one up? Oh shoot, oops, I shouldn't have bypassed it. Well, anyways, I'll show you this, because these, these things really aren't that hard, so it'll be alright. But yeah, so if you don't want to have to deal with these guys... Uh, you can just bypass Nav 2. But, uh, I don't mind dealing with them, because they're really not that hard. So, you know, speed up a little bit here. And, uh, alright. See? There's really no problems at all. Even if I don't have a target system. As long as I can find out where the enemy's going. Just follow that. These things go down pretty quickly. See, look at that. Boom. Uh-oh. All right. Man, my ship's taking... Man, I am taking a bit of a beating. But that's all right. Okay, so I'll finish up with these and uh, be back once I'm all done. All right. Piece of cake. But, uh, whew. Man, what is... What's up with my ship? Hopefully we can... Uh, Repair some of the damage, and uh, I can still be able to land this thing. But uh, yeah, that was a tough one there, BCS Universe. I mean, well, the stuff itself wasn't hard, but um, with all the different kills and stuff, that was tricky. So, all right. Let's check my nav map. Okay, now I can head back to Olympus, and uh, hopefully still be able to land this thing. 
Even if the comm system is just partly damaged, I'll be all right. But man, I got a lot of kills there. Got the sad music going. I know the the Clydesdale took a beating, but we were able to escort the uh, the Shard and Tanya to its you are clear to land to its destination. So hopefully that'll be enough to give us credit for the mission. We shall see, Beast Universe. We shall see. All right. Colonel Buster, this is Major Gentleman. We'll question the status report. Yeah, we did lose the Clydesdale, but the Shard and Tanya shipped out okay. Not Colonel. Ugh. That's okay. We should still be all right. We'll still be able to survive. Man, give me a break. I got a lot of kills, though. Yeah, yeah, yeah. you flare those eyes. Hmm. Yeah, you don't get mad at me. I'd like to see you try this. This is hard. Well, it was a tough mission, but we were able to get the Shard and Tanya out. Um, you know, get the supplies where they needed to go. And, uh, yeah, we should be in good shape. So we'll have to see what's next for us on Gora Car. This was a tough one, but we shall survive. Until the next time we meet, this is BCS Buster signing off. Take care, y'all.